All right, today is a very special video because we just recently crossed 1 million subscribers and I thought it'd be fun, we thought it'd be fun to go back into our vault and unveil the very first video that we, we ever attempted to film and edit, but I was too embarrassed to publish. You weren't happy with it. I, weren't ha I wasn't happy with it. So the recipe itself is a banger, it's chicken corn soup. So if you want the whole thing without our commentary, you can just go to our blog at mayoslaw.com. But let's dive in. And today we have a baby now. He started to cook since 16 age. Uh, over 40 years he's working in the Chinese restaurant. A lot of people Your dad. He just keeps today, looking off to the side. He's like, okay, when can I go? Look at all that. Does it look too busy for you? Yeah, this is like kind of a long intro. I feel like no one. Half teaspoon of the. So it's kind of hard to read. First, we need to cut all the your mom is amazing. Uh, really tiny. So from the beginning, your parents have always been very down. So the fact that your mom and dad were willing to do this and your mom was willing to take your dad and make him slow down was such a, I don't know, I felt like it was a big thing to ask in the beginning. Because your dad is always just like So for context, so if you watch our videos now, you, you might notice it's just my dad on camera. And for this, First, this is the first time we ever shot anything. They did it all in one take, like no hesitation. They're just like naturals, which is amazing. But <laughs> I think like my dad just cooks like really, really fast. So you can see in his fingers and his <laughs> eyes, he's just like itching. He just really want. wants to cook. <laughs> I lost a lot of sleep when we were planning out how to do these videos because I really wanted Chinese to be, or Cantonese to be at the forefront. Like I didn't want to dub over my dad, but I also didn't know how to like literally translate our videos for you guys to watch. So I was like, oh, okay, let's have my mom try to be on camera. Cause she was a professional translator. She used to work at a restaurant. So she knows like a lot about cooking and how to translate. And just like really quickly, we realized it wouldn't, it like really wasn't working. Cause my dad's like, just <laughs> itching Things to are burning. <laughs> <laughs> It looks more like frantic. No, I like it. It's like um, in the restaurant. That, sh that was shaky. Mm -hmm. I feel like it looks artistically so different. We were still holding cameras. We were holding cameras. Mm. Oh, real quick. Okay, post. <laughs> <laughs> so you can see that wooden stand. You want me to go get it? Uh, yeah, why not? <laughs> okay. Well, cat gets it. I can explain. So in the beginning, I was really inspired by like Buzzfeed's Tasty and like a bunch, like the hands and pan shots. I really wanted an overhead shots. I spent a lot of time working on this wooden overhead rig that we could mount on our kitchen countertop. But because it was like pretty tiny and we didn't have a lot of money to invest. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is a relic. <laughs> so, so yeah, this baby was with us for like a year. Like you can't have it on the kitchen counter and have my mom and dad, or even just my dad in the shot. So we had to film it twice. Twice. We filmed every recipe twice. So if you look, you'll see like a bunch of continuity errors, like stuffs in different places. Mm -hmm. And we basically took twice the effort needed to make a recipe video because mm -hmm. I really wanted this shot. He really wanted the overhead and we just, that this was the only option. Once we can film it only one time with an overhead that you can't see, saved yeah. you a lot of time. But our studio is evolved a lot just to say it was time. Like now we do like two shoots in one, in one shoot. One day. One day. It used to be like one shoot a day and I was like stressing. It took so long, yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, shout out to the wooden cardboard in the back. <laughs> wooden cardboard. The... Or the, sorry, the cardboard. Yeah. Shout out to the Splash. cardboard. Splash in the back. Yeah. We can see this is the most how your parents' kitchen like looked all the time. With the teas on the microwave. We got the papers on the We got the, the papers on the magnets. <laughs> <laughs> the, the light in the, in the corner, in the right corner still there. <laughs> Oh, also remember your, okay, this was a thing we really had to work on with your dad, is he always looked at us. Like we yeah. would be filming and we'd be like, Daddy, look at this one, look at this one. Yeah. 
Shaky, oh, shaky, shaky. shaky. Oh, <laughs> you are running too. Like I would be holding one, and you'd be running from side to side. Oh yeah, you were shooting. Of course, yeah. <laughs> I used to shoot. <laughs> so also, the Chinese, I can't read Chinese, but the Chinese are probably off because like during the edit, I would type everything out. It took me like 10 hours alone. And then I'd run it through Google Translate and give it to my cousin who would translate the Chinese. And then my mom would like go through it for another like 10 hours. In like, the beginning though, your mom wasn't going through it. And yeah, then she, she would just, see the final one. She's like, this is wrong. This is wrong. This like, is no. wrong. Like, no, we already published it. She's like, just change these things. You're like, you can't change it once it's published. Yeah. So that was actually our first hire was getting a translator. Cause mm -hmm. that was like the easiest thing that I could trust someone to offload. That uh, you knew you couldn't That I do. knew I couldn't do myself. <laughs> it saved us all collectively like 30 hours per yeah. video. Yeah. So, hold on. <laughs> this was like a big struggle. Like we edited this out, but like oh. we were like yelling at my dad to use like standard spoons. He's not even using a standard <laughs> spoon right here. Another challenge of starting a cooking channel as like an OG chef is like, they just don't measure things. Yeah. So like my mom, Kat, me, we all had to like pound my dad to use tablespoons and teaspoons. <laughs> or not like a bowl. He'd be like, yeah, you put a bowl in there. You yeah, know, like, everyone has different bowls. Yeah, I just use a cup of this random bowl that we have, <laughs> or it's a scoop of this random bowl that we have. <laughs> <laughs> You can add some of the chicken powder, maybe yeah. one, one teaspoon <laughs> chicken powder. Dad's like itching to add it. So my dad doesn't know where to look. <laughs> he still looks great. They're both such naturals. Mm. That's so different from your shots now in no. your forest suit. Oh, it's optional. You don't have to put it. Okay, so hopefully everybody <laughs> enjoy our corn and chicken soup. It's so wonderful. And taste good. Oh, and man. Easy to digest, easy to make. Some of the people who are very cute. Yeah. Oh, my God. No meal time. No meal time. Good job. <laughs> they oh did so God. good. <coughs> I mean, the crazy thing is that it's still a good video. It just wasn't exactly what you wanted. Randy loves perfect. You just wasn't right Very yet. Very high standard of yeah. video. We had different takes, different styles that we tried until we landed on. Yeah. what you felt comfortable to do. Yeah, we filmed all in all like eight videos before we felt ready to launch. Also, during this shoot, we didn't have Cam yet. Yeah. We were we didn't have that any children. We didn't have any children. <laughs> this was like May and like a month later in June 2020, Cam was born. So a lot's changed since then. A lot's changed, we've had two babies. <laughs> From the start of this shoot, like this very first chicken corn soup attempt to now, where we are now, there's no way we would have done it without our team and- The vision was there. The vision was there. And your hard work has always been there. What have you learned? Hmm. Your parents are amazing. Don't make me cry. <laughs> My love for them has grown. They're e extremely, extremely um, caring individuals who are just down to do this with Randy. I mean, not many parents would want to necessarily do this. They're just incredible that they want to do this with us as a family, that they want to share it with the world. I think they have a good time. So I'm just so grateful for their generosity of you know, their time and their knowledge. Yeah, I think this is just brought us all like a lot closer as a family. Like one would be like them having grandkids yeah. <laughs> brought us all closer, but two is just like, we have so much to look forward to working on me with Loud together. But it's just been a, a joy. There's a saying like, if you're not embarrassed by what you first put out, then, well, I guess I didn't put it out. <laughs> if you're not embarrassed, if you look back at your videos, you should probably be embarrassed a little bit to watch. Cause it, like, that just means you've grown a lot. Mm -hmm. And I think we've grown so much in the time since attempting this and there's so much more to do. So yeah, thanks watching. for your support. As Cameron says. Thanks for watching. <laughs> thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. <laughs> YouTube thinks you'll like this recipe next. Let's see if they're right. A huge thank you to our walk stars and all of our chefs in the Canto Cooking Club.